Duckham's is an iconic brand. Founded over 100 years ago, some of the first cars on Britain's roads had Duckham's oil lubricating their engines. The company has been a part of the fabric of British motoring for over 100 years, and as our transport and engineering has changed, so Duckham's has also evolved. We wanted to find out how one of Britain's heritage businesses is on the road to the future and driving innovation. Duckham's has been inextricably linked to the British transport history throughout the years since its foundation in 1899 by Alexander Duckham. He started the company in Millwall in London with just 200 quid lent to him from his father and it became very much a part of the fabric of the British motor industry. Duckham's was the first multi-grade motor oil that was brought into the market way back in 1951 was synonymous with engine oil, just like what Kodak was to films and Dulux was to paints, Duckham's was to engine oils. Indeed, a lot of the big major brands of the 50s, 60s and 70s, people like MG, uh, Triumph and Jaguar, all those iconic classic car brands that we know today, recommended that people use nothing else in their engines at the time. What really differentiates Duckham's from other engine oil brands is Duckham's is a 120 year old brand. The brand was born in 1899. So what that means is the brand has got great legacy, great belief, great trust with its customers and consumers across the world. In the UK and in Europe, we've probably got a combined uh, classic car market of about 8 million litres. Motorsport is substantially more than that, probably 15 times. The lubricants market is quite big globally. It's a 40 billion litre market. Uh, it's growing at 2%. In Asia, there is enormous opportunity as there are new vehicles coming in, new consumers coming in, and that's a big opportunity that is there for uh, Duckham's. Duckham's are known throughout the world as being green, and the reason for that is, and it still holds true today, is that Duckham's prides itself on using very, very highly refined, high quality Group 2 base oils. And when you highly refine oil, it goes very clear, almost like water, very light amber colour to it. And in the 1950s, people were used to black, goopy, thick stuff to go in their engines and didn't trust that this highly refined, pure-looking oil would be good for their engines, and that was how Duckham's became famously green. There are three areas that set our product apart. The most important part of the, uh, the engine oil is the base oil in the blend. We won't compromise and, and we use hydrofinished base oil. Um, the shear stable viscosity modifiers won't shear down and therefore the oil stays thicker for longer and engenders higher oil pressure for longer for, for classic cars, which has always been a historic problem. And uh, we make sure that there's sufficient protection reserve in our oils. Uh, even if somebody misses a drain interval, they've still got that protection. It's important that people understand that we're a trustworthy brand and that we've achieved great things in the lubricant market. Things like making the Mini possible in the 50s by creating an oil that could cope with the engine and gearbox using the same oils. Those kind of things we've done in the past builds justifiably trust in our brand and we can use all of that knowledge and expertise built up over over 100 years to ensure that what we're doing now celebrates the past but also ensures that we're making high technology, groundbreaking oils just like our heritage. Trust is really important in this market, especially in the classic car market of course, uh, who are buying oil for a cherished vehicle and it often represents quite a significant investment and a lot of love and passion as well. They want to be able to trust us, know us and also have an oil company that is a bit more personable and approachable. Educating our owners and enthusiasts is a very important part of the process for Duckham's. We're carrying this out by a combination of old and new methods. We have a substantial online blog that we're building on all the time, which talks about events that we go to, but also technical aspects of the products as well, in hopefully layman's terms that, that the enthusiasts can understand. And we're looking at events to train people in terms of seminars, lectures, and even in meetings at the clubs. It helps both sides. It helps the customer in that the customer knows what he requires for his vehicle. Equally, it helps us to sell the benefits of our products versus some of the products in the market that aren't so good. 
The vision for the next five years really is to take our heritage and the things that people love about the Duckham's brand into other markets as well with modern vehicles and to take a really strong British brand and make it a success across the world. Duckham used to be traded in its heydays in about 60 to 70 countries. So that's a lot of legacy, that's a lot of customers and a lot of consumers in those markets. And what Duckham's would do between now and the next three to five years is, is first access about 20 countries in the, in the next three years, and then hopefully by the end of five years, be present in almost all the legacy markets that the brand was present in earlier. And great brands don't die, they come back again.